I have not vlogged in a long time. But here's the thing, I've gotten a lot of new YouTube subscribers and stuff, so I decided it's been like a month or so since I did a vlog, and one of the things that was actually keeping me from vlogging was the fact that I felt like it had to be this huge, big, edited thing with music, and you know, I was trying different things. I was trying different flows and different styles of, um, you know, of filming, and right now I just got back from a workout. I trained a couple clients and I got my fucking sick pump on. Still making some, still making some gains. And if you remember, I was kind of out of fitness. I'm gonna get some food while we talk. I was out of fitness for a while in, in terms of like my own personal growth. I did like a month off from the gym and you might remember that I was kind of burnt out, you know, doing all these videos and doing the exercise videos. I was kind of really burning the candle at both ends, so to speak. So now, I'm back. I've been talking a little bit more about it. I'm almost done with my personal workout program. And what I mean by personal workout program is I created a program that's going to be available for everyone. So you can literally do what I do and learn from Papa Swolio fucking Normus. And the cool thing about this program is that it's for anyone. It's for beginners, it's for experts, it's for intermediate. It's great to mix things up. And I get my I ain't getting any fucking potatoes. Here, let me show you what I'm doing when I'm eating here. What is it? Got a couple grass-fed beef patties that I didn't finish the other day. This is like an amount this is like some white rice. What the fuck is that? White rice, some grass-fed beef, some eggs, some chicken. This is like a mix. Oh, this is like a meal that's ha, a couple pieces of cheese. What is that? Some pineapple, some mesomorph. That's some good shit. Literally, this is like diarrhea waiting to fucking happen. It's literally going to be like diarrhea everywhere. No, maybe not. Maybe not. Who got some steak and asparagus? <laughs> I'm going to eat everything. I'm so hungry. I'm so fucking hungry. I need, well, there's some potatoes in there too. I think there's some potatoes in there. Yeah, come on, a little carb action. Might need some more. So anyway, I did a program and I'm almost done editing and filming and I'm personally back, I'm motivated and shit is really doing well. Facebook is doing well. I have a couple videos that almost have about a million views. Got a ton of people, doubled my subscribers on Facebook recently and I've been doing a lot of these Q and A's when I warm up, I've been doing some Q and A so people can interact and it's going really well. I feel good. Everything is kind of on the cusp. I have a lot of stuff coming out that I haven't really discussed in detail, but it's something that will be obviously blasted across all social media platforms. Bacon, do I want bacon now? I not have enough food, I need to cook. So it's gonna be blasted, it's gonna be out there and I'm not gonna hide it. You know, it's going to be advertised. It's going to be really put out there. But the whole Swolnormous brand is really getting a name out there in the industry and in the social media realm. And everything that I've been posting about for the past year is finding a little bit more of a pace. And that's one of the most important things that I can give you in terms of advice is you have to try new things. And I tried doing daily vlogs. I did that for a while, like in the 40s or 50s of the Swole Motion, I did like a daily vlog, but at the same time, I, you know, honestly, not a lot of fucking stuff happens every day. That's why I'm backed off like the daily vlogging, but I kind of want to do this, but more of a raw format, you know, instead of like all the editing and the fucking time lapses and stuff, because this is not the only material that I do. I do daily shows, I do so much content, but I kind of want to keep a running diary so those of you that watch can kind of get a little behind the scenes. You can post up questions and comments and get a little bit, you know, back, you know, like I said, behind the scenes, behind the veil. And it's also for me because it's nice when I get to look back and I get to see where I was mentally and, you know, physically and where the company was and how everything's been developing. So program coming out. Uh, I'm motivated and I've been working out super hard, got back into it. 
This program is fantastic. Uh, the one that I wrote, so it's a combination of everything. It's pretty much everything from the daily swoles, the swole motions, all my exercise videos. It's my entire being. It's pure swole normus in a program format. So it's yoga, it's strength training, it's mobility, it's foam rolling, it's everything. It's stabilization work, it encompasses everything. So I'm really proud of it. And that's one of the reasons why it's taken a little while to get out there because I want it to be, I want it to be not that it's not good, I want it to be right. I want it to be, I want it to explain what I want it to explain. I want it to be delivered and able to be delivered the way it's meant to. And I will be doing more of these vlogs and give you some more updates, but I'm at a very interesting place mentally. I have a lot more patience than I did. I understand the game a little bit better. I was posting feverishly and I was doing driving while gainings like a few times a week. The daily swole I've always done every day, but I was doing the vlogging every fucking day. And the reason why I backed off the other videos and the exercise videos is because I could probably not post another fucking thing on YouTube for the rest of my life and have more content than 99% of the people on YouTube. So my take on posting videos is I will post updates like this and I'll post these things in vlog format and I'll show you guys some things like, you know, what I'm eating. It might not be the same. Yeah, look, at this. look at this. Really? This is all going to go in. It's not going to be the same format. It's going to be a little bit more raw. It's going to be a little bit more, you know, hey, what up? It's going to be more like a long Snapchat, but it's going to be more like a diary, like a journal entry. So today I did back. I ate, I, you know, I, it's the fucking grind, man. It's the fucking grind. And I think what people don't realize is that they got to fake shit. They got to fake shit for these vlogs because the day in the life of a human being, unless you're a celebrity and you're traveling over the fucking world, it's not that interesting. If you want results in the gym and you want results in business or in your life, it's the fucking hard work and it's the day in and day out grind and the hustle and all that bullshit but a lot of times it's the same fucking thing every fucking day. It's the same damn shit. And anyone that tells you differently is lying to you. You know, I don't want to pretend like, oh man, this is amazing. Look at this, you know, cloud formation and brrr, look at that speed. Wow, it's really entertaining to watch. I want to give you some real shit. I want to spill my guts out a little bit. I want to leave like a journal entry. I want to tell you where I'm at. I want to tell you what I'm thinking. And I'm motivated right now. I feel good. Sometimes I get discouraged. Sometimes it doesn't move fast enough for me, but I realize that it needs patience. So everything's growing. Everything's doing well. I'm doing well. I'm in a good place. And I feel really good in general, mostly because I found my mojo back in the gym. I found my desire to be healthier and to take more of an interest in my own fitness. Because when you're doing all these videos, I'm sitting in front of the computer editing and doing all this shit all the fucking time. I get burnt out. I get burnt out and I almost lost it. I took like a month off. And over the past couple months after that, I had to ease back into it slowly because I was so burnt out. Getting back into weight training was, I was so crippled sore. I was so banged up. And I realized how much I was beating myself into the ground. But I'm sleeping better. I'm focusing more on hydration. I'm doing everything the way I used to. And I fucking feel amazing. I fucking feel amazing. And I just wanted to check in here and tell you that there's gonna be more videos like this. I hope you like it. Leave a comment, leave a like. And if you like this kind of raw behind the scenes vlog style rather than all the other fancy bullshit that everyone's trying to copy, you know, other vloggers and other YouTubers, I ain't shooting in 4K. I ain't doing drone shots and all those things like those fucking squares. I'm giving you the behind the scenes of Soul Normas and of my journey. So it's going to get a lot more raw, but I want to post more on YouTube. I just don't have the time to do all this crazy editing. So I could do a lot more stuff like this. So if you like it, leave a like, leave a comment below. If you want to hear some more real shit and this way I can show you more stuff like what I'm eating, what I'm doing, what I'm chomping down on and you know how I feel. Ooh, not bad. Not bad. Getting there. I can give you guys some more updates as long as I don't have to put too much time into the post-production of these fucking videos because the real shit is hard work and it's a lot of repetition. So don't get it fucking twisted. Anyone that's doing all this stuff is making it up half the time. It's real shit, it's a real fucking grind and it's boring half the time. But it's a lot less boring when you have a beard. <laughs> Peace out, enjoy the fucking rest of your day, your night, eat some food like this, lift some weights and let's have a positive 
next couple weeks. I can't wait to release that program to you guys. I'll blast all about it on the vlog here on Facebook. If you're not following me on Facebook, check me out at Swole Normus. I'm live every day at 12. I do Q&As. I'm on Snapchat, Instagram, all that shit. So if you're new to YouTube and I got a lot of subscribers recently, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this video and let me know if you want to see more. Peace.